very good morning dear students today we are going to see about the tools for statistical analysis so in the, in the last class we have seen about quantitative and qualitative data and in quantitative data we have seen about the descriptive and inferential analysis and we have discussed each and every methods in detail and also uh, about the inferential analysis and today we are going to move on with the tools for statistical analysis namlu collect cheyidattalla datas idinokke namukku statistical tools use cheyidu analysis nadathiya nadathumbulana namukku adinde or actual ആക്ച്വൽസ് എന്താന്നുള്ളത് അറിയാനായിട്ട് സാധിക്കാം അപ്പോൾ ഇതിൽ പല പേരുകളും നിങ്ങൾക്ക് വളരെ എന്താ പറയുക പരിചയമില്ലാത്ത ടേംസ് ഒന്നുമല്ല വി ഹാവ് യൂസ്ഡ് ഇൻ ഓൾ ദോസ് ടേംസ് ഇൻ അവർ ബേസിക് ന്യൂമറിക്കൽ മെത്തേഡ്സ് എന്ന് പറയുന്ന പേപ്പറിൽ നമ്മളിതൊക്കെ യു ജിയിൽ പഠിച്ചിട്ടുള്ളത് തന്നെയാണ് ഓക്കെ അപ്പോൾ ടൂൾസ് ഫോർ സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്കൽ അനാലിസിൽ two major areas are varunathu there are two major areas of statistics related with research research ne relate cheyidittu namukku rendu main areas aanu varunathu one descriptive statistics and inferential statistics ee descriptive statistics is related with the development of certain indices from the collected data ava data sil ninnu namukku കിട്ടാവുന്ന ചില ഫാക്ടുകളുണ്ട് ചില എൻഡൈസസ് ഉണ്ട് ഓക്കെ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് വിഷ് വി ഗെറ്റ് ഫ്രാം ഡിസ്ക്രിപ്റ്റീവ് സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്സ് ഇൻഫറൻഷ്യൽ സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്സ് ഓർ സാംപ്ലിംഗ് സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക് ഇസ് റിലേറ്റഡ് വിത്ത് ദ പ്രോസസ് ഓഫ് ജനറലൈസേഷൻ ദ ഫോളോയിങ് അത് ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻറ്റ് സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്കൽ ടൂൾസ് യൂസ്ഡ് ഫോർ സമറൈസിങ് ദ റിസർച്ച് ഡാറ്റ അപ്പം നമ്മൾ ഒരു റിസേർച്ചിന് വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് നമ്മൾ കളക്ട് ചെയ്ത ഡാറ്റാസിന് നമുക്ക് സമ്മപ്പ് ചെയ്യാനായിട്ട് നമ്മൾ സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്കൽ ടൂൾസ് നമ്മൾ യൂസ് ചെയ്യുന്നുണ്ട് ആ സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്കൽ ടൂൾസ് എന്തൊക്കെയാണ് എന്നുള്ളതാണ് ഇപ്പോൾ നിങ്ങൾ നിങ്ങളോട് യു ജിയിലൊക്കെ നമ്മൾ ഈ പ്രൊജക്റ്റ് വർക്ക് ചെയ്യുന്ന സമയത്ത് നമ്മൾ ചോദിക്കാറുണ്ട് നിങ്ങൾ യൂസ് ചെയ്തിട്ടുള്ള സ്റ്റാറ്റിസ്റ്റിക്കൽ ടൂൾ ഏതാണ് നിങ്ങളുടെ റിസേർച്ചിന് വേണ്ടിയിട്ട് എന്ന് നമ്മൾ ചോദിക്കാറുണ്ട് ഓക്കെ അപ്പോൾ ഇപ്പോഴെങ്കിലും അത് മനസ്സിലാക്കാം എന്താണ് എന്തിനാണ് ഇതൊക്കെ ചോദിച്ചത് എന്ന് എന്നുള്ളത് ഇപ്പോഴെങ്കിലും ഒന്ന് മനസ്സിലാക്കിയിട്ട് അടുത്ത ഒരു റിസേർച്ച് ചെയ്യുമ്പോൾ നല്ല രീതിയിൽ ചെയ്യാനായിട്ട് ശ്രമിക്കാം ഓക്കെ സോ ഫസ്റ്റ് വാനേഴ്സ് യു ഹാവിങ് ഫൈവ് മെഷേഴ്സ് ഫസ്റ്റ് വാനേഴ്സ് അബൌട്ട് മെഷേഴ്സ് ഓഫ് സെൻട്രൽ ടെൻഡൻസി ഓർ ആവറേജസ് മെഷേഴ്സ് ഓഫ് ഡിസ്പേഴ്ഷൻ മെഷേഴ്സ് ഓഫ് സ്ക്യൂനസ് ആൻഡ് മെഷേഴ്സ് ഓഫ് ദി റിലേഷൻഷിപ്പ് ആൻഡ് അതേഴ്സ് ഓക്കെ ഹിയർ we are going to see about measures of central tendency endana measures of central tendency ennu parayumbo egadesham or mid value or average value ennakka venanundengil namukku parayam okay measures of central value are a typical value of the entire group or data aa parayunna value aarne aanu represent cheyunnathu aa particular group inde ക്വാളിറ്റേറ്റീവ് ആയിരിക്കാം അല്ലെങ്കിൽ നേച്ചർ ആയിരിക്കാം അല്ലെങ്കിൽ മറ്റെന്തെങ്കിലും ആയിരിക്കാം അത് വെളിപ്പെടുത്തുന്നത് ഓക്കെ സി ഫോർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ വെൻ യു ടേക്ക് എ ക്ലാസ് ഓക്കെ നമ്മളൊരു ക്ലാസ് ഉണ്ട് ആ ക്ലാസ്സിൽ ഒരു തേർട്ടി സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ഉണ്ടെന്ന് വിചാരിക്കാം അപ്പോൾ എന്താ പറയുക ഹെഡ് മാഷ് വന്നിട്ട് ക്ലാസ് ടീച്ചറിൻ്റെ അടുത്ത് ചോദിക്കുകയാണ് എങ്ങനെയുണ്ട് ഈ ക്ലാസ്സിൻ്റെ പെർഫോമൻസ് എന്താണ് ആവറേജ് എന്നുള്ളത് ചോദിക്കുകയാണ് So, average in the parayimbo, 30 students in the oro subject ilum, egadesham, avarikku kittunna mark ellam add eithu ondu, number of students in avich namil adu divide eithu, namukk uru value kittu. That is known as the average value in the parayimbo. Apo egadesham a class in the average, namukk kittu. അതിന് അനുസരിച്ചാണ് ദ നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഇയർ പ്രൊമോഷൻ ഉണ്ടായിരിക്കുക നെക്സ്റ്റ് ഇയർ പ്രൊമോഷനിൽ എന്ത് ചെയ്യും ക്ലാസ്സിന് ചിലപ്പോൾ ഒന്ന് ഷഫൽ ചെയ്യും ഷഫൽ ചെയ്യുമ്പോൾ ഈ പറയുന്ന ആവറേജസ് വീണ്ടും മാറും ഓക്കെ സോ ദ ക്യാൻ ഫോക്കസ് ഓൺ ദ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ഹു ആർ കമ്മിങ് അപ് അബവ് ആവറേജ് ആൻഡ് ദ ക്യാൻ ഫോക്കസ് ഓൺ ആവറേജ് സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ആൻഡ് ദ ക്യാൻ ഫോക്കസ് മോർ ഓൺ ദ സ്റ്റുഡൻസ് ഹു ഫോൾ 
below average. Okay, अब अंगने नमक इवरने separate चाहिए group out चाहिए नम, ओके नमक इन द वैनम, ये औरो measures नमक अत्यावश्यक आन. So आदेने नमक एक्चुअल helpful light वैरन्ना uh, central tendency measures इले आन. नमले ये कुछ method गल अंडे नमक one by one आयते नोका. Okay, it is average value of the entire data. In other words, it is a single value that describes the characteristics of the entire group. One group and the character and the nature and the other one is the value of the average value. Okay, so there are five types of averages mean, median, mode, geometric mean, and harmonic mean. So, these terms are not new to you, everything are very familiar, clear. So, we will move on with the first one, mean, okay. So, we have to learn about the formulas and the formulas and the formulas and the formulas and the formulas. Mean, median, mode, geometric mean and harmonic mean. So, we will see what you can say about mean and all other, okay. Mean, we call it as Arithmetic mean in all of them, we are That is the simplest measurement of tendency. It is a very manishin, Adigam calculation on Ariatur Victiki polum, but average at the Kanan of Arnagal, it is a elepum Chayavana or a method on mean in the rain, arithmetic mean in the rain. So, they have to do only one thing that is, they have to calculate all those things, they have to add up, sum up all the values which has been given to them and it should be divided by the total number of values. So, if you are giving 10 values then you have to add each each one of them and you have to divide it by 10. So, that is a very simplest method each and everyone can follow in Aladan. So, to know a simple uh, simply say to know about the average of a class or average of a frequency or average of a thing which has been given to you it is very easy to do as a arithmetic mean ok. So, the two formulas we are using here arithmetic mean is equal to sigma x by n that is they will be given they will be uh, given as x series number number of series lm sum up divided by n and the total number of series shortcut method mean is equal to a plus or minus sigma d by n a and the varayana assumed mean we assume mean we assume sigma d and the sum of deviations so, we have the sum of deviations in a base a that and n and the number of items ok mean and the simplest measurement of tendency and it is widely used in the other average are mean helpful mean ok and next is Mean is also relatively reliable in the sense that it does vary too much as the repeated samples are from one of the same population. It has limitations also, it is unduly affected by extreme items that is very large and very small items. So, for some items, we have a number of items, we have a number of Okay, limitations So, widely, normally or average item, or calculate group population Say for example, 30 values, 50 values, okay. If it goes beyond that, and if you give 1000 values, in the you can add it. Okay, if you want to add it, bigger population, it is not advisable. Okay, and second one is the median. Median is the middle value in the distribution. Now, in the distribution, the mid value that is to be considered as median. So, mid value kaanumbo, 1 to 10 and the paraimbo, nam kaile mid value kaanumbo, 1 to 9 and the paraimbo, nam ka mid value kaana na ita nam kele paan. Okay, 5 is your uh, mid value nam ka paraimbo, you are having 1, 2, 3 and 4, 
uh, and then 6, 7 and 8 in the array, uh, 6, 7, 8, 9 in the array, uh, the lumber in under. So, Namka then the mid value, the 9 numbers in the mid value, Namka, no, the fifth um, number in the honor and the mid value item, consider J another. So, if we have a mid value, first thing is we have to put into any order. Either you can put in ascending order nor in descending order. So, we select the mid value. In the order, we will the mid value. Either we will put in Mm, one number in before I the smallest numbers and I am in session where the biggest series I am in the initially the biggest series I am next to where another number later right where another smallest numbers I am so it is calculated why first thing is when you are going to calculate median it is very purposeful to make it into an order first thing bring into an order whether it is ascending or descending never matter and select the mid value that is known as median ok so median is equal to size of n plus 1 by tooth item in the ladana median the formula ok so number of series arrange it on the tender and or mid value kana in the ladana so that is what we have uh, seen in median okay and third one is about mode mode and the rainbow the value which occurs most frequently so given series which are numbers repeated and diary say for a for example in an uh, organization you are going to uh, take the uh, you are going to collect the data from the employees so employees in the pay room are they employees in the age room details so we collect the the age in the Varaina, the Avadilla Palaricum, Chalapore, Jairica. Okay, about Onil Kudel Alcarica, the same age of Alcari, Pala organization learned Iricum. So, number mode in the Varaima, number age in a related number to Kana and Dangil, I let him Kudel frequent I to appear a in the figure a dano that is considered to be the mode in the Ladana. Mode is the most common item of a series. Mode is the positional average and it is not affected by the values of extreme items. Mode is defined as the value of the variable which occurs most frequently in distribution. For the distribution, the time repeated figure that is considered as mode. So, mode is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean and all the other formula mode is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean. Okay, a normal series it is okay. And when you come to a continuous series, continuous series the problem mode is equal to L1 plus f1 minus f0 divided by 2 f1 minus f0 minus f2 into c. C in the bar another common that is common difference on uh, or a class interval in the class interval where in the common difference on a c in the bar another f1 f uh, f0 and f2 in the bar another namka the little there in the frequencies of the model classes on a very there another okay but continuous series on and then formula where in Normal series are in the 3 median minus 2 mean. Okay, and next is uh, we have we are moving on with geometric mean. Geometric mean in our is obtained by multiplying all the values of the series and calculating root. We have the series values we are multiplying it. Multiply it root kaanu na reethiyana geometric mean le varunathu okay geometric mean of n positive is the nth root of their products thus the geometric mean is obtained by multiplying together all the values of the series and then calculating the root of their product ella multiply cheythu kazhinjittu namukku kittuna values inde root kaana root kaana anundengil we'll get the geometric mean Okay, corresponding to the number of items in the group. 
अब नमक के कितना मल्टीप्लाई चाहिए थे कितना वैल्यूज़ इन्हें रूट का अंडर गए ना वील गेट दी ज्योमेट्रिक मीन इन अलग था एंड द लास्ट वन इस हार्मोनिक मीन हार्मोनिक मीन ले बेर ना द रेसिप्रोकल ऑफ वैल्यूज़ ऑफ वेरियस आइटम्स इन द सीरीज़ और போகும் Okay, so n divided by 1 plus x1 plus x2 plus x3 என்ன வரை இன்ன இக் கால்க்குலேசின் செய்து கட்டியிம்பு நம்க்கு கெட்டன்ன ஒரு மீனான harmonic mean என்ன வரை இன்னது harmonic meanல் மேன் ஐட்டு வெருந்தது என்தான it has limited application it gives largest weight to the smallest item and smallest item to the largest item item yang nalar dah. Abang, item kod de weight nama la, item smallest item ni kodka yang nalar dah. Ia satu harmonic mean orang nama la udeshi kena tu. It is clear that there are large number of averages. The selection of particular statistical average depends upon the nature, type and objectivity of the research. அப்போம் நமுக்கு இதலி statistical toolsலே ஏதானு நமுக்கு வேண்டது என்னுள்ளது அரியனம் என்னுண்டையில் நமுக்கு ஆதியம் தன்னே நம்டு type of research, nature of research இதன்ன base ஏதட்டானு which statistical tool has to be applied for this study என்னுள்ளதானு நம்மல மனசிலாக்கேண்டது okay so these are the things we have seen in measures of central tendency I'll, I'll uh, say once again that is mean adepolatenne median mode geometric mean and harmonic mean anju karyangalana nammal kandathu mean ennu parayunnathu is a simplest measurement of tendency uh, sigma x by n ennalladana mean de formula shortcut method aanu nendengi a plus sigma d by n median ennu parayal தன்னட்ல distribution the mid value mid value in the distribution series is to be arranged and the series is to be arranged in ascending or descending order அப்பு நம்க்கு mid value கண்டு பிடிக்கணம் என்ன அண்டையில் நம்க்கு அது ஒரு orderல அக்கணம் என்னல்லதான அது mixed up ஐட்டல ஒரு orderல அனு கடுக்குந்தது இங்கில் நம்க்கு ஒரு correct mean நம்க்கு identify செய்யான் ஐட்டு சாதிக்கில்லியா so to find out the correct median we have to put all those items in an ascending order nor in descending order அது கையின்னால் median is equal to n plus 1 by 2th item n அல்லதான் இனி mode mode என்ன வரையின்னது value which occurs most frequently in the given series mode is equal to 3 median minus 2 mean and if the problem is given in a continuous series and ending it mode is equal to l1 plus f1 minus f0 divided by 2 f1 minus f0 minus f2 into c c it uh, denotes the common difference between the class interval okay and geometric mean and the other calculate and then the value well the value some series is on that level value so number multiply jayana other guy net and i'm not in a root to calculate again okay so x1 into x2 into x3 into x4 இங்கன நம்மல we are going on multiplying it and finally our product இந்த multiply செய்தாட்டில் product இந்த நம்மல இந்த என்ன root காணும்ன ஒரு series ஆணும் நமுக்க geometric meanல் வெருந்து and last one is about harmonic mean harmonic meanல் mean என்ன வரையின்னது reciprocal of values ஆணு தன்னட்டலது okay seriesல் எல்ல values இந்தி reciprocal that is upside down so the formula itself denotes n divided by 1 by x1 plus 1 by x2 uh, plus 1 by x3 and it goes on okay so this is about harmonic mean and next we'll move on
to the measures of dispersion. Measures of dispersion will vary. The measures of central tendency indicate the central tendency of a frequency distribution in the form of average. These averages tell something about the general level of magnitude of the distribution, but it does not show anything further about the distribution. Now, so, this uh, central tendency we can tell something about the general level we can tell something about the general level we can calculate the average class average that's why we have a degree in the pass percentage. We have a pass percentage. We have a pass percentage. We have a pass percentage. We Okay, Apo especially it fails to give an idea about the dispersion of variables. In order to measure the dispersion, statistical device named measures of dispersion is to be calculated. Apo this range calculate yanam ennandengil. Ethar toolam idu dispersed item kandende. Evada verikum, evad aedu kuttegal verikum. Ennala calculation akka namle ethanam ennandengil. Namke use ennada the measures of dispersion an. According to Spiegel, the degree to which numerical data tend to spread about an average value is called the variation or dispersion of data. In the variation in the dispersion dispersion of data. Okay, variation in the parana term and item code will wear up just on the underline the The degree to which numerical data tend to spread about an average value is called the variation and the dispersion of data. The variation measure is used to test the representative character of an average. The following are the important measures. Now, we will use the measures that we use. The average and range of the range of the range of the range the spread item the calculation. First thing is the range, second one is mean deviation and third one is standard deviation. First one is about range. Range in the range the simplest measure of dispersion. Aana. So, that is calculated. Uh, highest value, that is simplest measure of dispersion and the range is equal to the highest value, difference between the highest value and the lowest value is known as the range in the range. Now, let's see how much American dispersion is going on. If we calculate the range, the highest value minus the lowest value and it is the very simplest measure of dispersion. Okay, and the second one is about the mean deviation. Mean deviation in the range is a measure of dispersion based on all items of in a distribution. In the distribution, the all items the measure of dispersion and mean deviation load. It is the arithmetic mean of the deviation of series computed from any measure of central tendency and it is the average of the absolute difference of values of items from an average. About the workout mean deviation is equal to sigma d by n sigma d and the sum of mean deviations on. Okay. So when you calculate that you can get the that is all items we calculate the calculate and mean deviation is calculated by any measure of central tendency. It is an absolute figure in all that. So central tendency is any measure we calculate the mean deviation calculated. To compare variation among different series which are expressed in the same or different units as relative mean deviation is required. Namke dinde, and the paraya oru compare enam dinde variations unde compare enam endandaengil. The coefficient of mean deviation can be obtained 
by dividing mean by the average used for calculating mean deviation. That is the main thing. Ethertholam on the variations in the comparinum in the relative mean deviation is known as the coefficient of mean deviation. So, coefficient of mean deviation is calculate mean deviation divided by mean or median or mode. So, mean deviation calculate mean median alingi mode idile edengilum oranam calculate cheya adond nammle divide cheyanannendengil coefficient of mean deviation namukku kittu okay and next one is standard deviation carl pearson introduced the concept of standard deviation in 1893 it is the most important measure of dispersion and it is widely used in many statistical formulae the local number paramavadi number catatla termum Carl Pearson's in the standard deviation. Umka, Valade famous itala, a ling in Umka, podum catatla uru, Valade parijema itlora term another. Okay. It is commonly denoted by the symbol sigma. For Umka then the symbol tanatla, the sigma in the ladana, sigma is equal to um, that is um, x square, sigma x square divided by. N. Okay, so we the total of the square deviations are sigma x square and divided by 10. That is the root of the standard deviation. Positive square root of the arithmetic mean. The arithmetic mean the square root of the Okay, assumed mean is the square root of sigma d square by n minus sigma d by n the whole square. Okay, that is the formula which is used when we uh, take it from the assumed mean. And if you if you are going to find out the coefficient of variation, any is the amalala variation in any other tholam and calculate standard deviation by mean into within a hundred on multiply j okay, that is standard deviation by mean into hundred and another. So coefficient of standard deviation it is a relative measure which is used to compare it with similar measure of the other series matter series nalladine namukku compare eyanundengi namukku cheyavuna oru method aanu coefficient of standard deviation coefficient of variation namukku nokkanundengi standard deviation divided by mean into 100 cheythu kaynal namukku idinde coefficient of variation kittum Okay, we will get the coefficient of variation. The square of the standard deviation is known as variance. Okay, the square of the standard deviation is known as variance in the Ladana. And last one is measures of skewness. The measures of dispersion give an idea about the spread of the observation about the central tendency of items. The measures of dispersion and measures of central tendency do not indicate whether the distribution is symmetric or not. We know that frequency distribution differ widely in their nature and composition. Even then they may have central tendencies and dispersions the same. Pakshay, namak adinda korchum odium detail it in the skewness like when the items in a series are dispersed in even fashion the frequency curve representing the distribution will be symmetrical if the distribution of the items in a series happen to be symmetrical curve of the distribution will be very normal it is known as normal curve in a symmetrical distribution, the items show a perfect balance on either side of the central tendency. In this case, mean, median and mode will be the same. Skewness is a measure of asymmetry. Okay. If we have a symmetry, we have equal measures are mean, median, mode, all the same value. But skewness is asymmetrical. It shows the manner in which the items are clustered around the average. The measure of skewness helps us to determine the nature 
and extent of concentration of the observations towards higher or lower values of the variables. Appa, edu node chayarana taanu namada variations verunna, the higher values node chayarana taanu, lower values node chayarana taanu in the ladana. It also helps to measure the direction. So, the higher values in the lake yana in the uh, direction adakka namukka calculate yana it is adhikum enna ladana skewness illo ude. So, uh, Carl Pearson's coefficient of skewness in the formula anu arayinna the 3 mean minus median divided by sigma. Okay. So, the number of standard deviation on the 3 mean minus median divided by standard deviation. So, you will get the measure of skewness. Suppose, we have a range of uh, values in the moment and direction. We will get the direction. Okay, in the problems that we will continue in our offline classes. Okay. Thank you.